everybody. My name is Katherine Emery. I'm a 20 year home improvement and lifestyle expert. What? I started with Home Depot back in 2001 and worked in house telling product stories for 17 years. Loved wearing that orange apron. Then I launched Be The Best Home in 2018, where I tell stories on TV nationwide about trending products and projects that people can do to make their home better. So today I'm gonna to show you a day in the life of what it takes to do one of these TV segments. I appear nationwide, Los Angeles, Phoenix, Houston, DC, Philly, and more. Today we're gonna to go on KTLA Los Angeles, one of my favorite stations. We're talking about top five trending projects for 2021. So I'm gonna show you what it takes to get set and be on TV. Here we go. Okay, well this is really where it all begins. You come up with a great idea, you pitch it to a news producer, the news producer says yes, and then you get to work getting ready to tell that great story on TV. Day in the life of a TV host. We're we're doing a hair today. Okay, just style, the usual just style. style. Yeah. Blow so, dry and do some curls. Yes, please. The magic at work. Now it's time for the makeup. Now, what to wear? All right, now it's time to get the products to put them on the table so that we can tell our story. Here's one of my home improvement cabinets, full of product to tell stories. I also get a lot of things in the mail. Amazon's my friend. So is UPS and USPS for that matter. All right, now it's time to get the table ready so we can tell the product stories. So I just have a, a basic folding table that I've put in my office. I've actually turned my office into a studio as you can see with all the lights here. Um, and I actually hung fabric on the wall here um, to make it a nice backdrop because that red was a little bit too bright. But this is how the table ends up starting. I'm gonna do a time-lapse time video um, so you can see me setting up. Ready? Ta-da! The set. And... Ta-da! The magic of lighting. <laughs> really does make a big difference. I've got uh, soft, warm white, so low Kelvins here and those really like bright white lights, so really high Kelvins there, because you really need a lot of light to see not only me, here's my, there's my cheat sheets, but also, see how good it looks? Okay, so we changed to be a little more colorful, otherwise I would blend into that background. Hey everybody, it's showtime. You're actually on a hot set. We're on standby to be on in one minute. Hey you guys, well let's get started by getting organized. All right, so as they say in show business, that's a wrap. Thank you so much for following along on my journey. Please subscribe to my YouTube channel to see all of my TV spots and great how-to videos. Follow me along on social media on Katherine Emery TV. And for more, go to bethebesthome.com. Bye. Whether you're looking to paint, organize, or transform your backyard, there is a project out there for you. Yes, all the above. Joining us live with the top five DIY trending projects is home and improvement and lifestyle expert, Katherine Emery. Hi, Katherine. Hi, you guys. Happy New Year. Happy let's, let's New get, Year. Let's get doing some home projects. That's right. Lots to do. Um, I'm huge. I love to be organized. I feel like it's an ongoing thing, and you have some tips on that. 
Well, then, Lou, I would like you to meet the uh, Rubbermaid Fast Track Rail Garage Storage System. So let's get organized, Lou, and start in your garage because when you organize your garage effectively, you can act as another room as your house. So like I said, this is the Rubbermaid, Rubbermaid Fast Track Rail Garage Storage System. It comes with a seven piece set. So it's a great starter kit. You have two rails, a power hook, um, um, a ladder, utility hook, cooler, J hook. So just enough, as you can see from these pictures, get your lawn chairs up, get your step tools, stools up, your rakes, your shovels. But here's the beautiful thing, you guys, you can keep adding to it based on your needs. So add shelves, bins, cabinets, racks, you can put bike balls, everything up there. Everything's off the floor and on the walls. So your garage is super organized and you can check this out at Home Depot, but just a great system. All right, now to a project that you say will change the look and the feel of a room and of, uh, of course, increase the value of your home. You put it perfectly, Glenn. So paint a wall. So I love these colors. So Benjamin Moore has selected Color Trends 2021 palette, and there are so many great ways to bring more, more color into your house. So their color of the year for 2021 is right there. It, 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 it's a, it's a G and teal, so see, you're ahead of the trend here. But don't you love that color? It's an intriguing blue-green, creates a natural harmony, invites us to take a moment to reflect. You can see here, they're showing the other 2021 palette. It's 12 rich Sunday cues, Amazon soil, Chestertown buff. So check it out, Benjamin Moore. You know, they've got over 3,500 colors to choose from, but I just love these 2021 colors. And especially, like you said, Glenn, you already have something like a G and teal in there. Don't you love the way it makes you feel? Well, I actually have actually, it in that's, my kitchen. Actually, that, that would be Lou. Yeah, I have it in my, <laughs> oh, that, I have that exact color in my kitchen, which I always wondered if I picked the right color, but maybe I did. You did, you're yeah. ahead of the trend, girl, I love it. Yeah, it's my family is very neutral. They have like neutral, neutral, neutral everywhere. So they think I'm the crazy person with color on the walls, but it's all good. <laughs> Let's talk about you're ahead uh, of the game. a homegrown garden. So, okay, so I love this. So garden industry leader Burpee has launched its first ever 2021 Burpee Garden Cast Trends. So these are five trends we need for 2021. They've been designed by their Burpee horticulturist, a nutritionist, and a home decor expert. Number one, plant an immunity garden. So think about it, you guys. When you plant your own um, garden that's rich in nutrients, things like tomatoes, you can see here, winter squash, radish, mm. Swiss chard, peppers and broccoli, right? Then you're then you're build, boosting your own immunity from home. And another one that I love is Garden of Joy. You can see here these flowers. These flowers are bright, lively, cheerful. They're gonna evoke happiness. Things like pansies, violas, cosmos, sunflowers. So go to burpee.com backslash garden cast and you can see all of these trends. They also have a quiet garden, a meatless Monday garden. Just really cool things from Burpee there. All right, let's talk about cleaning up. Uh, how do you get rid of dirt, oil, and grease? All right, so Glenn, I know you use microfiber at home, don't you? Do you? Pro <laughs> probably. I mean, His wife okay, probably. Why. She's laughing, Lou's laughing at me. So you need to switch up to microfiber, and here's why. Unlike paper towels and cotton cloth, it actually acts as a magnet to effectively remove dirt, dust, and debris. So you can see here, you can clean everything with these microfiber cloths. They're super absorbent. You can wash them over and over again. I know I'm geeking out, it's just the cloth, but it really is the most advanced thing out there. And here's, this is a huge clicky job site bag that you can just go grab at a Home Depot, but throw away those paper towels and cotton cloths because they're just pushing all that dirt around. You want that microfiber, and then the benefit is it's going to save you money, which is something we're all looking to do this year. Yep, and you can wash them too. Yeah. All right, well, thank you. I appreciate you being here. Your hair looks fabulous in some of those shots too, just saying. All right. <laughs> thank you. I For more information you. on Catherine and her home improvement projects, you can head over to her website. It's called bethebesthome.com. All right, did you... Uh... Liberty solve your garage problems there with uh <laughs> You know, she gave me some good ideas. I think I, I have to call a professional. Yeah, I think that's what it's gonna take. I just have a vision, but I, I need help executing it, you know? Yeah. Stella